Hi, everybody. <coughs> Excuse me. Woo. I'm still a little sick. Um, but I wanted to show you the... Uh, what am I trying to say? Oh. Okay, take two. Um, here are... Uh, here's like a complete set of... Uh, not tutorials exactly, but kind of a walkthrough of different graphics commands. It covers everything we're ever going to talk about for graphics. So you can feel free to just look through it. Um, on pa I just want to give you an overview here. So page one shows you kind of the basic template. What does your starting code look like? And then there's a walkthrough video if you want that. Um, this explains the coordinate system. And then the commands for drawing rectangles and ellipses and lines. Then on the next page, it's all about colors. How do you create new colors? How do you load different colors? How do you create random colors? This page is about how you set the backgrounds to be a color. Then I've got a whole page about using the keyboard, how you respond to different key events. And that's something we'll talk about soon, but you can get a preview of it if you want. Um, an advanced topic is responding to more than one key press if you want to press like up and left at the same time. This page is all about using the mouse. So this covers some of the stuff that we did last time with uh, mouse X and mouse Y, and then uh, the mouse pressed variable. <coughs> um, about displaying text here. Uh, this is about creating movement in your game, which is what we'll be talking about very soon. Um, this is about how you can load and display an image. Um, what else do we have? Creating a game with sort of different modes so that you could have like an intro menu and then like gameplay and then a game over mode. Um, and it looks like that's it. We'll try and be supplementing this with some other materials as well, but I just wanted to get this there for you in case it was helpful to look at.